All right, guys, uh, we found those two, the, the two remaining uh, periodical cicadas at uh, our last destination, at our last spot. Today we're here in York County, where surprisingly there aren't any uh, periodical cicadas here, at least not in this part, which is kind of odd because they're in every county surrounding it. Um, but uh, yeah, it's kind of crazy how long it takes for them to mature, 17 years. My son's seven, he'll be 24 the next time they emerge, which is pretty insane. But uh, yeah, today I'm gonna try and find our next reptile. It's either gonna be the... It's either gonna be the, uh, the Eastern Rat Snake, the uh, Eastern Milk Snake, or the, uh, the uh, Box Turtle, the Eastern Box Turtle. So, maybe we'll get lucky. And I'm hoping to find our next bird species too. Maybe a yellow throat vireo. That would be a good find. All right, let's go. It's an interesting looking bug. This actually is a true bug. So I'm allowed to call it a bug. Most, most of the insects that people call bugs are not bugs at all. I think I found this one before, a long time ago. So I'm hoping that we can identify him. He's gone. So hopefully we can identify it from that. We shall see. It's a pretty cool wasp. Look at that. That's cool. And he's gone. Gone with the wind. But where's my other boy at? All right. Well, if we find another one that looks like that, we'll get a get some better footage. All right. Let's move. There's a squirrel war zone going on up here. as you can hear. I'm pretty sure that was just a Eastern gray squirrel. I'm still looking for the uh, American red squirrel that lives here too. I would like to see one. They do live here. I just haven't, I haven't found them yet. All right, guys, I found a box turtle shell. So I don't count it. There is a box turtle shell, unfortunately. But it is a good sign that they do live here, though. That's the good sign. Um, so I guess we'll keep looking.
definitely a true bug. Hopefully that will be enough to identify him. I think so. Let's hope we can have some luck with this guy. Maybe he's new. I know we found him off similar to this. But I think this one might be a different species, so... Fingers crossed. Let's keep moving. Our next true bug species. All right, let's let him go. There's a spider, jumping spider. Alright guys, while I was looking at that other uh, jumping spider that I wasn't having much luck with, I found another uh, ant mimic jumping spider. He looks different than the other one I found. So I can't let him get away. I really gotta be on this. Yeah, he's definitely different. I need to be very patient and get as, many, as much footage and images as I can with this guy so we have a chance of identifying him. Oh man, our second ant mimic species. see him again yeah he's definitely a different species if he comes out into the open I'll try to grab him what do you guys think do you think it would be okay for me to bring a little container with me to stick the insects in and spiders so that they don't get away or should I wait and get them like this a little weevil if I can get him Here's a, a stilt bug. Yep. A stilt bug. I don't know how hard these are to identify. I'm not even sure how many species there are around here. But hopefully, is something we can work with. trying to hold it still guys but it's getting kind of windy so I apologize for that I 
figure I'd get some of these flies. I'm gonna wait for that jump expire to come back out. Maybe we'll get lucky. There's another jumping spider. He might be a little too big for this lens. We'll see what we can get. another uh, jumping spider coming in hopefully I can identify him he's coming up to the top he is very jumpy All right, guys, well, I found this uh, netwing beetle along with this other uh, jumping spider I could only manage to get a quick shot of. So hopefully we can identify them. All right, let's keep moving. I spent a long time trying to look for that uh, jumping spider and there's just no, no luck, so. Okay, here is our next mushroom. Here's the next mushroom if we can identify it. Here, not too many of them left. Orange mushroom. Hopefully we'll get lucky. There it is. Get the underside of it. All right. All I do is turn around, and I found this other 
mushroom or slime mold. One of the two. Alright guys, found another moth. Might have been the same one we found before this episode. Could be something new. And while I found that, I also found this uh, mushroom here. So, that's a twofer. All in one. that boy ever. All right, guys, that's it for this episode. I thought we got pretty lucky. We found a lot of different things. Um, we didn't find the reptiles we were looking for or the birds, but I felt like we got pretty lucky. And hopefully that squirrel was a red squirrel. You guys will find find out before I do. All right. See you next week. What's on your list? What's on your list?